Hi! Hi folks! The Korean Comfort Woman Mafia has been rather active. December 2016, they made a trip to the National Archives outside of Washington, D.C. and they located a film. In this film, they released something like seven months later at a news conference saying that this film produced by the United States military in 1944 was true that the Japanese captured Korean women and made sex slaves out of them. In essence, when we went to the National Archives, we discovered that no, that was a misrepresentation, a lie of what that film was. That film was Chinese prostitutes servicing the Japanese military captured by the Chinese military. There was no Koreans involved there in that equation, but according to the Mafia on the peninsula, they were Korean women. Now what they did, they released that film in 2017. Apparently they discovered another film when they were there in 2016, because they released it recently, and this one was of the dead bodies in an open ditch. And according to the news conference by the Comfort Women Mafia on the peninsula, those were dead Korean sex slave women massacred by the Japanese. To which I have to say, really? Or as we say in Japan, Majikayo! According to the National Archives, that was a film of dead Japanese soldiers who the bodies were being looted by Chinese military. No woman no Koreans involved anywhere in that equation. So now we have two films that they located at the National Archive that they lied about. But let's be polite, misrepresented. So now I explored the National Archives trying to predict what's the next films they're going to show and abuse and lie about. And let's look at this one. This one here, now I modified it because it's a little gory. It's of a dead woman. And we know they're going to show that one and they're going to say, You see, they massacred another Korean sex slave prostitute. That's what they did. No, that was a Japanese woman somewhere in the Pacific Theater of War. Now maybe they're going to use this one. You see, there they go the Japanese throwing these women on a canoe, tossing them out to sea so they can enjoy a Viking's funeral. No. Those aren't Koreans. Those are native indigenous people in the South Pacific who just visited an American warship. But they can use it, the Korean mafia on the peninsula, and twist it around the truth. But you know, while I was searching, I came across three other films that I am positive the mafia on that peninsula will never use. You ready? This one here is of Koreans. Not any Koreans. They captured Koreans, and not captured by anybody, captured by the United States military because those Koreans were hostiles to the United States during the Second World War. Now in this film over here, we get to see more hostile Koreans as prisoners of war who were fighting or engaging in something, if you want to call it, against these here United States and the Allies. Now we have another one. This one here is a prisoners of war, but they mixed them together because they were comrade in arms. Japanese and Koreans together as prisoners of war, comrades in arms, in an attempt to defeat the United States and the Allies. Now this card here, this documentation, illustrates, demonstrates, shows Japanese and Korean prisoners of war in the Battle of Okinawa. Gee! Koreans being caught as hostiles against the United States along with the Japanese. And yet they were saying, gee, we were victims in that war. No, we were the victims. You tried to defeat us. And now you want to get sympathy with us, right? <laughs> now you're by twisting the truth. It's not going to work. You were part of the military force that attempted to defeat us. Now you're trying to disassociate yourself with that military force. It doesn't work. You and the Japanese were like this in that war. And 
that's okay. There always are two sides to a war. And it's okay to be on one side and somebody to be on the other side. But don't deny it. You keep telling the Japanese, you need to stop denying your history. You on the peninsula need to stop denying your history. You were part of the Japanese military. And these films that are being released by the mafia, they're lying about their true intentions and what they are. Let's see what other films they release so I can expose their lies in the future. And to comfort women mafia, thank you so much for this opportunity to expose your ignorance. Baka. All right, folks. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. God bless the nation. You happen to be. <laughs> and God bless our good friends and trusted allies in the land of the rising sun, Nihon Japan. See ya.